Hospitality property owners, hoteliers, and operators of bed and breakfasts, you all should consider getting on TikTok because if you use it right, it will gain you bookings, make you money, and give you control over your image in a way you've probably never dreamed of. Plus, it's actually pretty fun. Let's have a look. Firstly, please subscribe to this channel if you have not already and click the bell to make sure you don't miss any videos going forwards. Today, I'm going to give you a brief enough summary as to how TikTok can work for your business, but bear in mind that we are working on a complete course on social media for hospitality marketing for which TikTok will have a whole section, including very specific approaches and examples. So be sure to head over to the Hotel Club link below and subscribe to our newsletter to keep informed of exactly when that will be coming out. So today we're going to look a little at what it is and don't skip it if you think you already know because I guarantee you, you'll learn something. Some basics on how to use it, uh, how specifically it can make you money and then make sure you stay until the end because that's when I'm going to tell you the very best reason to use TikTok. So first, what is it? It's a social network. Next jokes. But it actually isn't a social network in the traditional sense. It's much more apt to call it an entertainment platform when you see how it functions. Let's ask someone born this millennium. For me, it comes down to a couple of things. First, it offers a different way to interact with viewers that's really unique and creative. Features like duets and stitches make it easy to engage in a way that other platforms just don't offer. Second, you don't need a ton of followers to go viral. The platform itself takes care of getting your content in front of people. You can start from scratch and still get huge visibility, which is really cool. I'll walk you through some of the basics on how to use TikTok. First up, you've got your homepage. To keep watching videos, simply swipe down. The content you see is tailored to your preferences, thanks to TikTok's ever-evolving algorithm. So when it comes to creating your own content, you don't have to stress about reaching the right audience. TikTok takes care of that for you. And to create your own content, just tap here and start recording. Or you can also upload some pre-recorded videos here. So the purpose of any social network is to rapidly compete for your attention and none does it so rapidly as TikTok. Apologies to anyone who's already familiar with the app while I show you briefly how it works. So when you load TikTok, you're presented with a short video, often well under a minute in length, filling your smartphone screen. When you're ready to see something different, you swipe up and a new video selected specifically for you by the service's recommendation algorithm is pulled in to take over your display. So you're watching a video and you decide to switch it after three seconds. The next video has a guy making a sandwich and you watch it for slightly longer. The video after that is a dude exercising and you watch that for even longer. And you flick again and there's every chance you'll see another exercise video because the app is using what you've looked at before and seem to enjoy to give you things you'll enjoy more. You want something specific, you search it, and you want to see everything someone particularly publishes, then you follow them. So it's simple, right? So simple and so easy that everyone has started to copy it and it has completely changed social media as we know it. Cal Newport, author of such self-help classics as Deep Work and So Good They Can't Ignore You, both of which I highly recommend, published an article in The New Yorker last year in which he detailed the lateral moves that platforms such as Facebook and Instagram have made just to keep up with Tic Tac, presenting short form content options of their own. Those platforms built their initial algorithms around social connections between people. This means they would advertise based on commonalities of interest between what you and your friend group like. In the article, which we link to below, Newport quotes a study done by the Wall Street Journal that showed that an app could target a user's interests with a high level of accuracy in as little as 40 minutes on the app. So how do you use it? Well, here's the basics. You can be creative as you like or follow trends or both. There's an editing app called CapCut that is as user-friendly as it gets. I made this on it. Or you can do trends. These trends are simply something that people are doing a lot. So if you get caught up in them, you get more eyes on your channel. And the more time your videos are viewed, the more you get suggested. The thing to keep in mind is that while something like Google was built, or at least now certainly runs more in favor of brands being searched, let's say, TikTok is unabashedly about the user. If you tag your videos cynically and inaccurately, the algorithm will not be fooled and you'll be downgraded. For example, I might tag this video with a TikTok marketing hotel and beard. And yeah, ginger. 
probably for best results. So how do I make money from this, you might ask? Not to shield you directly, but there's a hotel from my neck of the woods, Woodstock Hotel in County Clare, look them up, who are huge on TikTok. They do a mix of trending topics and comedy sketches and every video they end with some kind of direct promo. And I've heard through the grapevine directly that they really work for them in terms of business. They've been able to link them to tours coming from the States. Huge money to be made if you can land that kind of thing in the West of Ireland, particularly because tour operators know their own performance will be rated well if customers get on well with staff in the hotels in which they stay. And when they watch these videos, they distinctly get the feeling that the lads running the hotel are good fun. It's not rocket science. They're marketing to the kind of people they want to get, and there's very few lines more direct than TikTok to speak that kind of language. You might accuse me of citing anecdotal evidence, but no, I have it firsthand as well. I refer you once again to my young person. It's incredibly straightforward to find hotel recommendations on TikTok. All you need to do is search for hotel in Canada, for example, and you'll be presented with a mix of user recommendations and videos made by the hotels themselves. I like to make my decisions based on a combination of both. And if that's not enough, I've linked to two articles below by some independent bloggers, the New York Times and Forbes, I think they're called, indicating that a lot of people these days are simply using the platform as a search engine, saying they find the results less biased than Google. True story. Which brings me to the best reason to get on it and get using it to promote your business. It's fun. I've said this before and I'll say it again. If you're watching this kind of content, you're obviously interested and invested in your profession or business. You're involved, you enjoy it. This gives you the opportunity to express that sentiment while making money. Thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, share, and send to your friends. Get on our newsletter over at thehotelclub.com. Oh, and follow us on TikTok where there'll be plenty more of this kind of thing.